Nigga, I wouldn't have came. He's like, oh, you said you only wanted two. And I said, I ain't never say no shit like that. He's like, oh, well, I might have heard you wrong. You ain't want me in the house with your bitch, bro. That's weird as fuck. Oh, God, I'm like, I'm just going to go home tomorrow. I wish I would come down here and look for a room and all that shit, bro. I really feel like I'm supposed to have second choice, to be honest with you, cuz. You just the promoter, bro. No cap. You the promoter. Let's be a hundred. You just the promoter. Out of the game, you... Think about it. Cuddy had his Cuddy from Atlanta and had an Airbnb that was full of people. That just gotta show who fuck with you cause you fuck with somebody else, bro. If I ain't coming to that party, Cuddy house gonna be more packed than yours. A lot of the motherfuckers that came to your Halloween party was coming cause me or somebody else was. It was nobody there for you. Then I get there and I'm supposed to find somewhere to stay. And he fixed it. Got the people, the DJ. He said, oh, the DJ need a room. So I told the DJ they can have a room. So he gave the DJ his room and stayed on the couch. DJ had more respect than I did. Boy, this nigga crazy. It wasn't my party. When we got there, it wasn't nothing near. It wasn't no food or no drinks. We had to go to the grocery store and shit. How the fuck I have a party where I'm from and it's... It was his first time. He don't know no better, but that's definitely one of my shit. That's why motherfuckers was fighting. Motherfucker, you got to pay for shit and type of shit, and you ain't a bitch, and I ain't shit. I ain't had no money to be here anyway. They just be mad for no reason. Because they fucked up. Finna go back home and be fucked up. I'm gonna start a fight with a bitch. Like they did start that fight with they started that fight with oh, that's cause the nigga was charging. Nigga ain't supposed to be charging shit. But your cell phone. Yeah. Huh? No. Uh, I'm telling them check on um, price line. Uh, uh, He ain't gonna remember none of that tomorrow. He be that drunk. Oh yeah. Uh, I definitely done with that shit. You know, I ain't mad at him or nothing. I don't even want to go in on dude. I don't even want to. I don't even want to talk about the shit I know about. I just, I'm just speaking on today. Right now, nothing, none of that means that. But I definitely can't fuck with him. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no.
All I can say is the man, the man got to get some, some, I don't even, I don't even want to say help. But definitely something happened in his childhood or something that's got him fucked up and when it comes to relationships. Relationships and trust, he don't have them. Now, if you don't got no trust with the bitch you laying with every day and fucking on and nothing and bitch and telling you love and you go marry, you definitely can't trust nobody in the streets because your bitch was stronger than anybody. You gonna trust the motherfucker? I know you don't fuck with me. It ain't a motherfucker in the world that can say, I was in my relationship, I was talking to them like, oh, my bitch ain't shit. Uh, fuck this bitch behind her back. Never. Never nothing negative, period. I promise you. I ain't saying nothing about you. You don't think it's crazy. That's why that girl Chi Chi blocked me. There's a girl out here named Chi Chi, right? She wanted me to do some promoting for her shot. I sent her to promote some shit. And I went in her live to ask when she wanted to do it and this and this and that. And she told me, she's like, I think you the one shot. I told her, I said, yeah, you was in my inbox. When you want to do the show? Or when you want me to promote you with, like, so you could be there for whatever she was promoting. It was to win some type of shit in a magazine. I went in her live later on that day. That motherfucker, as soon as I went in there, I'm like, what the fuck? So I done went to the window, shot in the box and kicking it and shit. And I'm like, hey, man, why the fuck she blocked me? He's like, oh, man, I don't know. She be tripping sometimes. I don't even know this bitch. And my nigga Carrie ain't no DL man. What the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> yeah. Uh, that'd be cool. I don't be minding because I don't be knowing them anyway. For you to be telling me, like, I ain't no Bella. When he first met her, he like, Bella, I took her from Polly God. I'm like, never seen her with Polly God. God don't watch dudes. I'm just sitting there showing me pictures and shit. Well, you have some off the wall shit to say. I ain't gonna mention it. But she is gonna get something fixed. She was goddamn letting her body go. And she was sending you money and she was saving her money to get something fixed. That's an insecurity that she has. You know what I'm talking about, nigga. Bella don't look be- in real life. Bella look better in real life than the camera giver. Facts. Y'all know I ain't doing no yellow shit anyway. So you definitely can you can leave her outside to dry. And she different too. Like I don't know her, you feel me? I only know her from Shy, but in my mind she like was introduced to me as a hoe. So that's how I'm looking at this bitch, like she a hoe. But when you meet her, she don't get that. She don't get that. She don't give it. I ain't lying. But that nigga crazy. He introduced me to this lady as a prostitute that was paying him. Then he finna marry her ass. She said he beat her up.
Man, I swear to God, guess what's crazy? We was at the bar. Shaw G and Polo was getting into it about something, arguing, right? I don't know what it was, but they, I just went over there to break it up. And Polo was saying some shit, right? And I was, he was right. And I was telling him, bro, you got to understand who you dealing with, bro. You arguing with him about doing some real nigga shit. You can't argue with Carlton Banks about acting like Will Smith, bro. That's exactly what I told him. He said, dude, really, like, he cool, but he not no street nigga. He hang around him, but that's not him, bro. He like Carlton Banks. He just hang with some cool motherfuckers like he in a fraternity, so he know what cool is, but that's not him, bro. And you got to respect him like you getting mad because he's not Will Smith. That ain't him. He Carlton Banks. So you got to be cool with him being Carlton Banks. And he's like, you right. You right. You right. He shook Shaw's hand and everything and then went back to doing this one too. He told Shaw I was wrong. My bad. My bad. Because it made sense, bro. He don't see shit. You can't make him see it like this. I'm just being honest. I ain't talking about him. He not. He, he not. He cool. And he you don't have that thing with him and all that. Oh, God. He ride around like that, but. Mm. I'm cool with kicking it with squares. I kick it with Carlton Banks ass niggas. But I like to kick it with Carlton Banks that know they Carlton Banks. Like I have a nigga with me that I know if we get into it, he ain't trying to get into that. I know I can't hold you accountable for not jumping into this shit because that ain't true. But I chose to hang with you, so I got to be cool with you still being you. Can't be like, oh, we got a hit because you ain't jump in it. You know how you a fight with your nigga, nigga, like from the hood. And you are getting a fight and you be winning and your niggas still jump in it. Right. But you with Carlton Banks, you getting your ass beat. And Carlton Banks watching. Like, and waiting for you so we can ride together and talk about, man, I know where you, I wanted to, man. You be like, what the fuck? Like, that's him. I had some cool times with the nigga, to be honest, but he got some shit. Yeah, I fucks with everybody. I'm cool with Carlton. Nobody. That girl that he left in Miami had the same story. That girl that went to Dallas with us had the same story. All of them said the same shit. Yet it is. Damn, I forgot about Yetta. Yeah, that liquor just bring it out. He got some shit going on. And he know that liquor triggered it. That's why he said, I'm going to quit drinking. Because that liquor be triggering, triggering that shit. Shout out the only nigga I know that can bust a nut and still be ready to fight the same day. Like, the one that you gave you a nut today, you ready to hit with, bro. He 
He was drinking conservative, conservatively. He had quit drinking like, I'm cool. I don't want to get too drunk, get too lit. He was sitting the cup down. You got to be around him, though. You would know. If you around him, because shy, cool. He chill. He laid back. And when you look at him, you will, he don't give off no. Like, he a nigga that you could see six, seven, six, eight walking down the street. You wouldn't cross the street because you scared of him. If he had that mean mug type with the green eyes and shit, then the motherfucker would be like, dude, look like a killer. He don't get that off. But when that nigga be mad, if you ever see him mad when these females disrespect him, oh God, his face be different. He had that cross the street look. When he get upset, that nigga turn green for real. Yeah, he ain't cool for what he was doing. We be chopping it up, shit. Yeah, musty. <laughs> oh, I ain't gonna read that up. <laughs> he lost some weight, man. Yeah, Polly God, but you not you really don't get to like speak too much on it. She left you first and said you was kind of abusive and taking all her money too. She said you owe her some money, like type shit. She said you was doing the exact same thing. She said, I can't believe I just keep going from bad motherfucker to bad motherfucker. That's what she said. Like, she said she can't catch a break, bro. Nah, P. This is what happened. I, I introduced her to the game. Mm -hmm. I turned that out. She made a couple thousands over here. She tried to run with the game. I got the the email for the make a personals. I hacked the account, so now she can't post nowhere. She tried to run off with the game and post somewhere else by herself. So I hacked the shit back after I put her on to the shit, and then she cry on Beagle talking about I hacked the iCloud lying ass. But I got the make a personals back, so she squared up with Shad. What what Shad did with her is two different things. What I did with her, two different things, nigga. I turned that bitch out to a 304, nigga. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I put that bitch on. And she tried right. to run with the mega personal, nigga. She tried right. to run with the motherfucking game. Fuck that bitch. That's what the fuck she get. And she lied to God Zeus talking about I bruised her legs when I showed the video that she fell off a bike. Now she went with a real nigga that beat her ass in real life. But you ain't never with her ass. That's karma. She lied on me and she you whoop really her, got ass, her ass beat. Have you ever whooped her? I never before? put hands on her. The only thing I did was took the mega personal back and, and got the account back. Everything uh, her stuff. You, really the game, you can't turn a bitch out to the game pimping and all that and you ain't putting your hands on the Like you either was turned her all the way out to the game or you halfway pimping. Which one? You gotta pick one. I am not against you. I'm just being you gotta pick one. And you turned her all the way out to the game. You brought her in, la, la, la. You took the mega personals, not because you ain't wanted to make no more money. You didn't want her to make no more money and not give it to you. But she went to a nigga that didn't want her making no money. So, therefore, you took off live. She talking about, no, I need help. Then she checked her cash out. She like, oh, thanks, guys. You guys only sent me $35. Mm. Hey, but, but probably she's in my face. Yeah, but you're I, supposed I ain't to. No but I'm you talking about problems get mad and hit bitches. No, but yo, huh? the girl that was pregnant said you was beating her ass too. Who? One else God has never said you. I put hands on her. You can't put. You ain't no receipts out there. There's a video we got into an argument. She called police. It wasn't no physical. You said you, you, and you took her. She it said you took physical. bands from her also. Or oh, her? She was working. And she was paying her tuition fee. When you come and be my students, you got to pay a tuition fee. Nah. Hey man, what this? 
with an extended shout out to Big Red, uh, Jitty, Stay Liddy, and New Yorker. Man, y'all light skinned niggas, man, doing too much, man. You light skinned niggas, man, got to fall back a little bit. Who? What up? Why are we even letting him in the box trying to kick a woman when she already down? Huh? Polly got up here trying to kick that girl when she's down. He oh, it's cool. He's speaking right now. It's cool. He, he cool. I got it. I got it, John. Don't kick him. He deserve a voice. He kick him. He go go somewhere else and say we weren't trying to hear him out. We deal with the truth over here. He, you know. Whatever we believe, we believe, and whatever he believe, he can believe. We know what's going on. If he say something that makes sense, then cool, but he ain't said shit. We know what was going on. That girl ran away from you. You was play pimping. That's why. Then you on here giving the game, we'll talk about mega person. Those men, these hoes still don't skip the game. Now you got bitches looking up mega personals like it ain't going to give you motherfucking step-by-step -step instructions for them to make some money to put your pictures up. And that app weak as fuck. That $150 ass app. That motherfucking pussy be going for $100 and $150. Boy, I see why your hoes mad. They're giving away their body for a pair of Jordans with the manager's discount. What the fuck? I was trying to get in here and I was trying to tell you some websites and I said, why would I do that? <laughs> Let him stay stupid. <laughs> so mega coochie getting ass. Yeah, mega pussy selling ass. <laughs> I turned the wrong to megas, man. He turned this bitch on to the goddamn apartment money. <laughs> That's why you and that motherfucker, all that pussy you got in there is supposed to be being sold. You and that little ass supposed to be high rise ass apartment you think you eating it most expensive piece of furniture that purple chair he want to feel like a pimp so bad